The International Alliance of Women (IAW), French: Alliance Internationale des Femmes (AIF), is an international non-governmental organization that works to promote women's human rights around the world, focusing particularly on empowerment of women and development issues and more broadly on gender equality. The basic principle of the IAW is that the full and equal enjoyment of human rights is due to all women and girls. It is one of the oldest, largest and most influential organizations in its field. The organization was founded as International Woman Suffrage Alliance in 1904 in Berlin, Germany, by Marie Stritt, Millicent Fawcett, Carrie Chapman Catt, Susan B. Anthony and other leading feminists from around the world to campaign for women's suffrage. The IWSA was headquartered in London, and it was the preeminent international women's suffrage organization. Its emphasis has since shifted to a broad human rights focus. Today it represents over 50 organizations worldwide comprising several hundred thousand members, and has its seat in Geneva. From 1926, the organization had strong ties to the League of Nations. Since 1947, the IAW has had general consultative status to the United Nations Economic and Social Council, the highest UN status possible for a non-governmental organization, the fourth organization to be granted this status. The IAW also has participatory status with the Council of Europe. It has representatives at the UN headquarters in New York, the UN office in Geneva, the UN office in Vienna, UNESCO in Paris, the Food and Agriculture Organization in Rome and the Council of Europe in Strasbourg. It also has representatives to the Arab League in Cairo and the Gulf Countries Council in Riyadh, and is an influential member of the European Women's Lobby in Brussels. Its president and chief representative to the United Nations is Joanna Manganara. Its current main UN representative in New York Soon Young Yoon is also chair of the NGO Committee on the Status of Women, New York and first vice president of the Conference of NGOs. IAW's official working languages are English and French. History The decision for the establishment of the organization was taken in Washington in 1902 by suffragists frustrated at the reluctance of the International Council of Women to support women's suffrage. The alliance was formally constituted during the 2 NDIN Berlin in 1904 as the International Woman Suffrage Alliance and was headquartered in London for much of its history. Its founders included Carrie Chapman Catt, Millicent Fawcett, Helena Lang, Susan B. Anthony, Anita Augsburg, Rachel Foster Avery, and Kata Schirmaker. Amongst subsequent congresses were those held in Copenhagen 1906, Amsterdam 1908, London 1909, Stockholm June 1911, and Budapest 1913. The French Union for Women's Suffrage UFSF, founded in February 1909, was formally recognized by the IWFA Congress in London in April 1909 as representing the French suffrage movement. The IWSA also started its own monthly journal, the Jeu Suffragé. The IWSA, influenced by Millicent Fawcett against the militancy of suffragettes in the style of Emmeline Pankhurst, initially refused membership to the WSPU at their 1906 Copenhagen meeting. In the late 1920s, the organization changed its name to the International Alliance of Women for Suffrage and Equal Citizenship, and in 1946, this was altered to its current name, International Alliance of Women. The first executive board included Carrie Chapman Catt, President, Anita Augsburg, First Vice President, Donovan Bolden, Second Vice President, and Rachel Foster Avery, Secretary. The organization's first president, Carrie Chapman Catt, also founded the League of Women Voters in the United States during her presidency. The organization's traditional color, used to symbolize women's rights and women's suffrage, is yellow. Conferences First, Washington, D.C. 1902 Second, Berlin, 1904 Third, Copenhagen, 1906 Fourth, Amsterdam, 1908 Fifth, London, 1909 Sixth, Stockholm, 1911 Seventh, Budapest, 1913 8th, Geneva, 1920 9th, Rome, 1923 10th, Paris, 1926 11th, Berlin, 1929 
12th, Istanbul, 1935 13th, Copenhagen, 1939 14th, Interlaken, 1946 15th, Amsterdam, 1949 16th, Naples, 1952 17th, Colombo, Ceylon, 1955 18th, Athens, 1958 19th, Dublin, 1961 20th 21st, England, 1967 22nd, Königstein, West Germany, 1970 23rd, New Delhi, 1973 Organization An international congress is held triennially in the home country of a member organization, and elects the executive board. The current president and chief representative to the United Nations is Joanna Manganara. The executive board also includes the secretary general, the treasurer and until 20 other members, including two executive vice presidents as well as vice presidents for Europe, the Arab countries, the Arab states of the Persian Gulf, and South Asia. Topic: Presidents. Carrie Chapman Catt, USA, 1904 to 1923. Dame Marjorie Corbett Ashby, UK, 1923 to 1946. Hannah R Y D H, Sweden, 1946 to 1952. Esther Graf, Denmark, 1952 to 1958. Easyland Darinayagala, Sri Lanka, 1958 to 1964. Begum Anwar Ahmed, Pakistan, 1964 to 1970. Edith Anrep, Sweden, 1970 to 1973. Irene Delipkowski, France, 1973 to 1979. Olive Bloomer, UK, 1979 to 1989. Alice Yatopoulos Marangopoulos, Greece, 1989 to 1996. Patricia Giles, Australia, 1996 to 2004. Rosie Weiss, Austria, 2004 to 2010. Lida Verstegen, the Netherlands, 2010 to 2013. Joanna Manganara, Greece, 2013. Topic: Current status. The IAW represents more than 50 organizations worldwide and has attracted many individual members. The IAW was granted general consultative status to the United Nations Economic and Social Council, the highest level possible, in 1947, and has participatory status with the Council of Europe. The IAW has permanent representatives in New York, Vienna, Geneva, Paris, Rome, Nairobi and Strasbourg and addresses the European Union through its membership in the European Women's Lobby in Brussels. The IAW's current representative to the UN headquarters, Soon Young Yoon, is also chair of the NGO Committee on the Status of Women, New York. The IAW pays particular attention to the universal ratification and implementation without reservation of the Convention on the Elimination of All Forms of Discrimination Against Women and its optional protocol. The current IAW commissions deal with the topics, justice and human rights, democracy, peace, elimination of violence and health. Members. See also List of suffragists and suffragettes List of women's rights activists List of women's rights organizations Women's suffrage organizations Timeline of women's suffrage Timeline of women's rights other than voting